Hello guys, this is Jay Amita of class 10 A. Today I am going to explain you the topic stress management, which is a topic of self management skills. Now first we will understood what is self management. Self management also referred to as self control is the ability to control one's emotions, thoughts and behaviors effectively in different situations. Basics of self management, self awareness, responsibility, time management and adaptability. Now what is stress man management? Stress can be defined as our emotional, mental, physical and social reaction to any perceived demands or threats. These demands or threats are called stressors. Stressors are the reason for stress. Stress management. Always keep in mind the ABC of stress management. A. Adversity or the stressful event. B. Beliefs or the way you respond to the event. C. Consequences or actions and outcomes of the event. Now, the benefits of stress management. Stress management can help you to have a joyful life, focus and complete task on time. Be a happy person as you are stress free. And last, be more energetic and spend quality time with your friends and family. The elements included in stress management are relax, music, hobbies, meditation, therapy, motivation, travel and exercise. The three steps to manage stress. Step 1. Be aware that you are stressed. Look out for signs of stress such as headache, sleeplessness, sadness, excessive worrying, nervousness, etc. Only when we are aware, we can manage stress. Step 2. Identify what is causing you stress. Find out the reason for your stress. Is it because of exams, family pressure, money issues, not eating good food or any other reason? Step 3. Apply stress management methods. Use time management tools to manage your time well. Focus on the important tasks and get them done. Talk to someone close about the issue like parents. Now the management techniques. First is time management. Proper time management is one of the most effective stress relieving techniques. Second is physical exercise and fresh air. air. A healthy lifestyle is essential for students. Stress is generally lower in people who maintain a healthy routine. Healthy diet. Having a healthy diet would also help you to reduce your stress. Positivity. Focusing on negative aspects of life will add more stress. Instead of learn to look at the good things and stay positive and think positive. Sleep. We should get a good night's sleep for at least 7 hours so that your brain and body gets recharged to function better the next day. Last is holidays with family and friends. Vacations can help you break from the normal routine and come back afresh. Now the ability to work independently. If you can become a calm and a relaxed person, you will have the ability to work independently, which means first becoming self-aware, self-monitoring and self-correcting. Second, knowing what you need to do. Third is talking the initiative rather than being told what to do. Fourth is the recognizing your mistakes and not blaming others. Fifth is having the ability and the will to learn continuously. Now the emotional intelligence. 
emotional awareness the ability to identify and name one's own emotions second is harnessing emotions the ability to harness and apply emotions to tasks like thinking and problem solving managing emotions the ability to regulate one's own emotions when necessary and help other to do the same some steps to manage emotional intelligent are first is understand your emotions observe your behavior and note the things you need to work on you can then work on the things you need to improve second is rationalize do not take decisions abruptly be rational in your thinking and take good decisions and take time practice do meditation and yoga to keep yourself calm now the emotional intelligence can has elements like perceiving emotions using emotions understanding emotions managing emotions etc thank you very much